Hey stupid loves! Hi! Hi, I'm Pretty Please, Singapore's top Lady Gaga fan in my Stupid Love t-shirt and today I'm going to finally be trying out some House Laboratories makeup. So I got a whole bunch of lipsticks as well as eyeliner and her Stupid Love palette. So for all of my fellow little monsters out there and makeup lovers, you're going to want to watch this video till the end because I'm going to tell you how you can win this. What is this, you may ask? And to that I ask, were you even listening? <laughs> so in this set, there are five Gaga lip crayons. No wonder people always do this. It actually works. Yeah. <laughs> as well as the black liquid eyeliner. Before I try using all these products, I want to say shout out to Universal Music for sending over this set of products, as well as another set for you guys to win. And also shout out to my friend Jaden for sending me this stupid love palette. I wanted to get it, but it was sold out and he got it on Amazon. So shout out to Jaden. Thank you. So BRB, let me get my base done first so I can make this canvas a bit more workable. And then we can get straight into all this. These are all the shades from the Stupid Love palette. I'm a dumbass who does not know how to swatch makeup, so this has taken a lot more arm space than it usually would. So am I a dumbass? Yes, but are the colors beautiful? Yes. <laughs> Hi, because I am a clown. Here are swatches from the House Labs website. You're welcome. Okay, so let's do this. So as always, I'm gonna begin with the outer corners and I'm gonna use the shade Sign for this, okay? So Sign is the electric blue, the in-your-face blue, so wish me luck. Okay, so the palette's obviously very wild and I think on her website, it's evident that you can create a lot of like intense and very over-the-top looks. So I'm just gonna try do something that is Wearable, or at least wearable if you're bold, you know, aka me. When I first heard the Gaga album, which was 29 May, the day it dropped, and I did my reacts video, I think the, the impression that the album left for me was that obviously it was a wild, like, dance your ass off kind of album, right? But I think I left, like, still loving the singles more than anything, and, and freaking out at her transitions, obviously, those were mind-blowing. And I think now that it's been two months, what are the songs that I still have on repeat? That's the important question. So I still sing every word when like Rain On Me and Stupid Love come on, for sure. I did not think I would love this, but I think the transition was just so good. So I just I just go back to listening to 911 quite a bit. I love Enigma a lot. And Chromatica 1, 2 and 3, you know, underrated. <laughs> Can I just say I love how this has a massive mirror in it? So my clown ass doesn't need to be like looking elsewhere. Thank you. Thank you Lady Gaga. You get me. Okay, so I would say the outer corners are done. Now I'm gonna go in with the orange. So usually we would go in with like maybe a lighter blue because that's like your transition shade. But I think I'm gonna do something that I've never tried which is to use a shade that is completely not a transitional shade, you know, a whole ass different shade. And for me, I'm gonna be using the shade Enemy, which is the orange of the palette. So I'm gonna put that in next, and the inner corners, I will go in with Peace, which is the turquoise shade. So the color is not popping out as much as I love it to because I used the dark blue below. So I'm gonna do what any Nemi. I'm gonna do what any makeup artist with a brain would do, aka use a primer. If you don't have an eyeshadow primer, you could also use a concealer. Oh my gosh, big difference. So I'm not gonna go all the way to the inner corners, I'm gonna save some space so I can use the, the turquoise shade. And I'm just gonna go back in with a little bit more of the blue, because I might have concealed a bit too much. Okay, and now that that's done, you want to go in with a way tinier brush and you want to take the turquoise straight. I'm going to take a little bit of peace. Oh my god, this is, this is wild. So now I'm just going to go in with the orange over this to like blend everything a little bit better because now it's quite segmented. Okay, so this looks really cool and I've never like done any like eye makeup look that looks like this. But I think that this still looks a bit too like yeah, I'm thinking of using one of the metallic shades to like blend this a little better. So something that would blend with the orange lah. So I'm thinking of using Sour Candy which is this shade. So 
So what I'm gonna do next is the under eye. So for the under eye, I definitely wanna do something that has the colors that I have on my lid already. But I think what I need in the inner corners is gonna be something that's similar to a white. And actually the palette does have a white. This one is 911 and this one is light up. I'm gonna use light up instead because it's shimmery. And oh my god, can I just say one of my favorite things that came out of the Chromatica album has to be Naomi Watanabe's parody. She did a freaking remake of Rain On Me and she literally like, she had the same damn outfit as Lady Gaga, okay? Like, how? You know, usually this kind of thing, they don't even make plus size. But then, she make already. So where can I get one too, Naomi? That's what I gotta ask. Okay, so I think I'm done with the inner corners. And I think for the other corners, I'm gonna go in with orange or blue, I can't decide, <clears throat> can't decide. Maybe I'll just do the black motion. I'm gonna try motion. Okay, I think I'm actually done with the eyeshadow. So right now I'm gonna go over with the eyeliner in Punk, the black eyeliner that is super iconic. So as I'm shooting this video right now, just 8 hours ago, Gaga posted this on Instagram and she announced that Chromatica got nominated for 9 VMAs. So that's insane. And are we surprised though? That's the question. Are we surprised? And that's how you wing it, bitch. Kidding, sorry. We are done with eyeliner. So honestly, like I think I've grown to love this look a lot. Before that, I was like, okay, it might be a bit much. Pretty, you're wilding. Will these colors even work? Pretty, are you a dumbass? You know, I was just spiraling in my own head. But now, as I see it all come together, I'm like, actually not bad. You know, not bad at all. For the next step, I'm gonna go put on some lashes because this look obviously deserves lashes. So let me get that. So I'm gonna put on this pair of lashes by Cass. Okay, so my most dramatic pair of lashes are on and now I'm gonna do highlight, blush and contour and I will be back to finally put on the lip crayons. Right off the bat, I feel like this, the last shade here, I feel like this one will work the best. This one's called Rebel. So these are the shades from top to bottom. It's Fire Me, Rebel, Talk Dirty, Destroyer, and 1950. I'm gonna go straight in with Rebel directly on my lips and let's see how this goes. So with the lips done, I think we're finally done with this House Laboratories makeup look and all I can say is I am very impressed with the... I love the lip crayon so much, didn't expect it to be such a pop of colour, it looks so good and I stand by the colours that I thought were like my favourite shades from the get-go. I love Peace a lot, like world peace. And Sign is also an electric blue that I think I've never tried before. Okay, so now that I'm done yapping, I'm gonna go curl my hair and come back looking extra cute. So here's the part that you guys have been waiting for. Here's how you can win this set of House Labs makeup which includes one liquid eyeliner in the shade Punk as well as five lip crayons in the shades Talk Daddy, Destroyer, 1950, Fire Me and Rebel, the one I'm wearing right now. So all you gotta do is post up a TikTok using any one of Gaga's tracks from the Chromatica album and make sure you post that TikTok on Instagram as well and tag both Pretty Please as well as Universal Music and make sure you're following both accounts as well to stand a chance to win this set of House Labs makeup for you guys to recreate your own look. Honestly, just go wild, have fun with it. If you're a Gaga fan, you know that. Just do you lah and have fun <laughs> and we'll pick our favourite TikTok to win this set of makeup. And now, it's time for me to show you how you want to be when you use house labs, okay? Oh, what's this shade? Oh, this one's called Fire Me. Yeah, what I told Media Corp. Name a more iconic duo. Oh, so you haven't heard the transition between Chromatica 2 to 911? Sure. Thanks for watching this video. Let me know if there are any other makeup looks that y'all want to see me try or any other makeup brands that y'all want to see me try as well, okay? So I hope y'all enjoyed this. And now it is time to hashtag stream Chromatica. Thank you. Bye-bye.